So I managed to install the uh, dynamic DNS on the uh, OpenSense, as you can see here. So now if I just wanted to add a service, we'll go and look at it right here. And as you can see, I have a list of quite a few uh, service providers. Now the reason I wanted to uh, use this is because we go to the uh, router here. I'm on the DNS or DDNS uh, part of this router and if you take a look at this we have two. So that's the difference between an actual uh, I don't know what do you want to call it um, this type of router. Um, here is the way you install it. The, those are the instructions you have to install a uh, what do I call it? Plugin right here. So going back, as you can see, you have more options to use different uh, service providers, and there is the free DNS as well, and a bunch of others which, for whatever reason, they don't have anything here. So this is pretty. Um, useless if you're not using one of those two uh, service providers for your DIN DNS. Um, they do work, I believe I've used both in the past just to test them out. But uh, that's the big difference. I mean, when you don't have options, that kind of limits you quite a bit. And here you go. You have a nice long list. But you do have to uh, set this up on your own. Obviously this is not installed so you have to set the uh, plugin in order to use it. So I hope that helps and I'll see you on the next one.